Okay, recording into Jam Pro using OM or AUM, however you pronounce it. Open the AUM, select your source like Elastic Drums in the source slot, and then load Jam Pro. Don't load it into the effects slot, load it directly from the home page. Sorry, that wasn't very clear, but that's the idea. Don't use AUM to load Jam. Here we start a new pack, fresh pack, Jam opens, and now go back to AUM and load Jam Pro into the effects slot in AUM. Right, there we have it. If you played Elastic Drums, you wouldn't hear it because we need to enable monitoring in Jam Pro. Go to Mode, select Sampling, hit Monitor On. Turn the input gain down so you've got a healthy level there, not too loud. And now we're good to go. You see the record icon is now Microphone. Press Play. Nothing happens in Jam to be press Play. And now we can tap any slot to start recording. We've got pre-roll set to zero, so it goes straight in. We've got Max Bar set to eight. But we can drop out after four bars or five. Okay, that was recorded five bars. If we turn monitor off so elastic drums isn't coming through, normally it would drop out automatically after the max bars you set. And there is our recordings. And now what you're listening to is that lovely new clip. By the way, the bar length is reported incorrectly. This is a bug with which, which we're fixing. Yay! There's always a workaround. Yeah, it's pretty decent having um, these interrap audio facilities in Jam, thus we get access to the incredible range of uh, synths and drum machines like Elastic Drums, made by our friend Ollie and Matt Davey, alias Wes, who's one of the main coders on Jam Pro. Sorry this video is a bit basic by the way, but we wanted to get this information to you ASAP. Jam on.